ever, the Ashland Jam. We, for years, did Jane's Jam on Thursday yes. nights, which got us all up and dancing. And every once in a while, we bring it back when you least expect it to shoe shopping with Jane. So I have to say, I am so excited. But guys, we have to start up here. Like, we just got to yeah. start up here. We really do, because this is it. Every single leopard print that we've seen this season has flown. And to my knowledge, this is the first time we've done this full yes. on leopard in a, like a slip on shoe, not a heel, not a pump. Oh my gosh, we have it in leopard. It is made just for QVC. It's brand new. This is your first look and the easy pay is leaving us at the end of the day. So we have it in that leopard. Come down here for the beautiful black snake. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh. And if you get close yeah. that's even a change so, in leather yes. so it's suede <gasps> again with that foil overlay it's creating this gorgeous imprint mm. in the like the panel and it just again it's like black but it's so not boring yeah oh my gosh and then of course the richest most elegant dark tan snake which is like a chocolatey like a true oh pure milk gosh. chocolate brown and wow. look at the nap okay on so that. i'm just telling you right now kim i apologize i don't even know if there's going to be any leopard left tonight oh That's no i how, was gonna wear it i don't know <laughs> 500 gone mostly in the leopard don't wait don't wait don't wait but i'm so excited because i own a lot of ashlands and i have never had an ashland no, leopard we did this especially for qvc Thank you. this is such a big deal our Ashland bottom is our most popular shoe bottom here at QVC. And everyone loves it because it's so much more than a flat. It's right. got a little lift, but it's a wedge. So it's completely flexible and bendable and broken in for you. There is absolutely no work required. You just slip on and go. But look at how nice the toe box is. We have that raised seam over the front. It's what's framing it. A nice low profile, so it's not, it's like, you know, if we had done it a little higher, maybe you'd be like, that's a lot of leopard for mm -hmm. me. But I love that, you know, go you if you're willing to go here. It's all suede, by the way. And then you have that stretch right here. So that's what's giving you that incredible flex. But I really think we need to see this on we the do. ladies. We do. And you know what? We're all going to represent. Yeah. Because Sheila has the dark tan uh, snake. I have the black snake. And then Miss Kathleen scored the leopard. I'm telling you. You, you heard it here first. If you want the leopard, I would not be shy. I'd be getting this now. And you know, I really yes. take my job seriously. We, we have this whole thing fall for Q mm -hmm. right now. Have you seen any yes. other Antonella talking yeah. about her job? Uh, Dan uh, Hughes was talking about his love of the outdoors and redoing cars. Um, of course, um, our fabulous, you know, gem girl talking about that as well. Um, Miss Nancy Hornback. And then they asked me to shoot something over this last week okay. and of course do you want to guess what i talked about what shoes? i love yeah i talked Maybe? about shoes oh okay good talked guess about shoes. <laughs> but i talked about the fact that when my mom was expecting my sister she fell and she like broke the, the bones in the top of her foot and they wouldn't really set it correctly because they didn't want to it was right before she delivered yeah. they didn't want to impede her circulation so it it like you know kind of yeah. grew back not the best way. I mean, it wasn't a big deal, but she just had this bump on her foot and it really meant made shoe shopping tough, mm -hmm. which for her, she was always walking around in a peep-toed high heel shoe. Like right. she was such a fashionista. She's the one that said, every woman needs a pair of red shoes. Thank you, Sharon Dasher, for coming yes. up and selling out today. So I said, I, I almost feel like it's this this nod to my mom when I can help you find a shoe if you right. have a, a foot problem or you have a big trip coming up. Mm -hmm. So, and I'm telling you the story because when you go to my Facebook and say, I'm going to Ireland, I'm going to Italy, I'm going to Disney, I'm going here, there and everywhere. If it's not hot and you can't be in the Lexi Marigold, I'm telling you to put on an Ashland yes. and the Ashland jam is new. Can you imagine being in Paris and walking oh around my gosh. in these leopard shoes? And we were talking about color with leopard, yes. right? I mean, fuchsia? I was like, can everyone write in on Facebook if they think I could wear the fuchsia with the leopard? Yes. Because that you will be yeah, okay. in the 9 p.m. Our show. Our stylist is nodding okay. and saying, yes, All right. you Thank can. you. Because I was going to wear it with solid green, but yeah. I like... 
So I've seen oh, women, and I love this whole new thing of wearing red with leopard. Yeah, me too. I right? love that. And to quote Alana and Lisa Marie on our shoe shopping team, they said, you know, when you're really not ready to go head to right. toe leopard. Like um, my friend Cindy, who is our gem guru behind the scenes, she walked around the corner the other day in a leopard dress Fabulous. and a long red um, duster on top of it. And I'm like, I'm stealing that look. That's amazing. Yeah. But if you say, I can't do head to toe leopard, you just yes. add this. And everybody that looks at you from the grocery store to, you know, going to work or going to volunteer will say, oh my gosh, that woman gets it. I just yeah. read in a fashion magazine that that's a must. -have. I mean, I've always loved leopard. I love antique furniture as well. And for my um, 16th birthday, I asked for a vanity, like to do my makeup because yeah. I was 16. And I got this gorgeous vanity. My mom and I went to a million antiques and what did I pair with it? A leopard upholstered stool. Oh. And guess who took that? Mom. Mom. Um, you owe me my vanity back. <laughs> Mom, she knows where you live. Yeah, I so, now have a house. So. And here's the thing, okay. Everybody and their mother is probably going to do leopard this year, yeah. but they're not going to do it with the comfort, That's the with difference. the built-in DNA of Clarks that you're seeing here, with the best-selling footbed worldwide, women from all cultures, all walks mm -hmm. of life, all ages, no matter what, you know, I always say I'm a seven and my sister's a seven, but shoes will fit us right. all very differently, mm -hmm. but there's something about this last of Clarks because you do it specifically for your shoes. You don't farm these out. And say, no, I'll just make a we shoe. don't order someone else's last. We make all of our own last, which is the model that the shoe's made on. We take so much pride in our styles and we really want to meet those trends, but we never compromise comfort when we do that. No, you don't. So I'm sorry, I'm all over this. I know. Oh, get it while we have it. So it's been really popular, okay. this shoe. Obviously, since we just kicked off this presentation, it is $74 in the future. It's brand new today. It's called a first look. We've never seen it. And oh, by the way, Easy Pay's leaving us at the end okay. of the day. So if you look Look at this and say, you know what? I'm gonna go for it. Yeah. I'm gonna get black slacks and a bright red chunky sweater, and I'm Love gonna wear it. this to my neighbor's holiday party that they have every year. I'm also gonna wear it right now with a white t-shirt and a pair of little black shorts. Mm -hmm. Like this is a buy now, a wear black now sundress. Shoe. Oh my gosh! So we're going to Washington D.C. Oh, next I week. Love I don't even DC. think I told you that. No. And I'm we're taking the train with the boys, oh, and I fun. really have to be strategic with packing because yes. I'm gonna have them and right. the suitcase, and we're gonna be in a train, not our car. So I'm thinking I might need to you take need these. You need this, yeah. So you could do the leopard yeah. and pop that. But let's not forget about this. I know, you know, we're distracted by like by the shiny, pretty. <laughs> by colors. But, <laughs> I mean, this is what happens to me, though. I'll go to get dressed, and I'll need a beautiful, really elegant black mm. slip-on shoe, and I'll find I don't have right. a black slip-on shoe yeah. because I'm distracted by prints and colors. So if you say, you know, it's been a while since I upgraded that gorgeous, Gorgeous black shoe. If you told me this was six hundred and seventy-three dollars by a major designer that you know doesn't care about comfort but just cares about you know their name, I it. would not be surprised. Yeah. That's how beautiful these snakes are. And let's face it, wait, duh, Jane, snake along with leopard is the biggest thing of the mm -hmm. year. But if you say I, you know. I posted a picture of Stacy Stoffer in yours truly, and we were both in snake print. And somebody said, "I don't, I don't wear it. I don't like that." So this is a way to have that nod yeah. to that look, and either the beautiful dark tan or the black, without being this over the head. You know, you know not why over your head print. I like the black and the dark tan. So like, I like feminine, flattering pieces, shoes, jewelry, everything but I will never do a plain style. Like you will never catch me in like a plain black t-shirt. The t-shirt has to have a cutout or it has to have some sort of like grommet right. or something. Or a ruffle. A ruffle, yes, like today. But what I love is this is black leather, but it pops because you have that suede inlet with that foil overlay. So it, it's hard to see, there it is. When you get this home, you'll know it's not your plain black. It's no. so unique and right. different. And that's how I am, like traditional with a twist. Right. And I think the same goes for that dark tan, which is that suede. Beautiful. 
Oh my, look at that. I'm just running my finger over it. That's the test of true, truly good suede when you see how it moves. I have an update. No, I I'm know. gonna wear it in two well. hours. So it's brand new today. <laughs> and the easy pay is leaving us at the end of the day. So if there's ever that little Tinkerbell moment flitting around your head like a fairy saying, okay, you really need to buy the shoe. I'm Tinkerbell going bling with my fairy dust. You need to buy the shoe because the easy pay is going away at the end of the day. However, no. We started this show with 3,500 in the Leopard, pretty much probably for the entire season. I don't know if we can get this back in stock. We have 1,600 left. Now that might sound like a lot, but in shoe world, it is not because we can be in so many people's homes right now. And I don't want you to come to Shoe Shopping with Jane in a couple weeks when we have the Ashland Jam. And we put out the Leopard, which like, you know, more than half of what we brought in is now all gone. We bring in the black and we bring in the dark tan. And all of a sudden on red light, green light on the bottom of your screen, everything under the Leopard is gray box, gray box, gray box, meaning it's completely yeah. sold out. So if we come back over here, it's, you know what, and I'm even gonna do this. I'm gonna bring all three. And I really, I wouldn't mix my Leopard. Ooh, you even have a Leopard oh. handbag. Oh Isaac. my wow. Oh, is that Isaac? Look it's at Isaac. that with like That's stingray. Isaac? Oh, Ooh. Ooh. Isaac. I yeah. mean, you know, if you wanted to get leopard and, right? Right. So this is so comfortable. This is so cute. And you also have easy pay leaving us at the end of the day. It like Amy for you, like in your Washington DC moment, yeah. if you, you know, wanted to just bring two shoes that were going right. to go with everything, this has a completely different vibe right. than this does. It doesn't look like I'm in the same shoe. I mean, didn't we just nail it with that yeah. leopard pattern? You did. It is, leopard, like I said before, it can go trashy. I'm sorry. It can go the wrong direction right. in leopard. And this is so high end. It's so right. And classy. And it is suede. This is not a man-made material. This is truly suede. That's a good point because a lot of leopard shoes out there are going to be printed on two yeah. faux. Right. And when you have the suede, you have that breathability. You have mm -hmm. that elegance. You have that beauty. But don't you know, run away from the black or that dark tan either because like, I'm sorry, every Italian and French designer does a slip on loafer. They all do it. Right. They will not have the footbed. They will not have the outsole. They will not have the comfort. I always joke and say, like when you're in that sort of like, you know, name, I had our 25th anniversary a few years back and so splurged on that shoe. Oh, I remember and some, those. Yeah, yeah, you were there. I and somebody there. said to me, are they comfortable? And I burst out laughing. I'm like, no, my feet are <laughs> killing me. But you know, it's a look. Oh, they were so cute. They, yeah. they were like, yellow, right? They were. Yeah. Oh look my gosh. See, so Black, specific. red, and yellow, yeah. Um, with my my Little silvery, dress. yeah. Yeah, my Millie. Silver. Yeah, that was straight though. I, I know, that. I know. I was in a straight dress that night. What in the world? So we had about 3,500 leopard shoes we have 1400 left all right just save one i for know 9 maybe one for tonight so <laughs> rush 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 off to the phones get the ashland jam but that easy pay is leaving us at the end of the day now we've talked 